All right. Yeah. Swords, why? Oh yeah, that's right, we got the bunny mask. Yo. We're here. Yay, swords. So many swords. I don't have a double, double jump. Uh, that's okay. We'll get one. Oh, you got a promotion? Are you now the assistant to the manager? Just eat that. Um, don't mind me, I'm just being a... Silly person. Plenty of torches. Really remember everything that we've accomplished. Group leader on an airport. Oh, that sounds like an important job. No gravitation potions yet. Where do we want to go, and what do we want to look at? Hope it will be better. You not enjoying, uh... Your work? have one blink root. Why don't I start a YouTube channel? I have a YouTube channel. Type exclamation point YT that'll give you a link to the most recent video on YouTube. Uh, also... So here's the thing. Um, Twitch has a much lower... Um, it's easier to get things rolling on Twitch than it is on YouTube. Uh, YouTube takes considerably more time and uh, effort to get a lower return, so to speak. Um, I've had a YouTube channel for a little over a year, and I mean, it's primarily just uh, cut versions of the VODs from uh, the stream. I'll uh, cut the VODs into more digestible sizes, basically. Do I have any bottles? What the heck? Sell my soul? Nah, I'm good. Uh, YouTube is a dying medium. At least as far as making money. I don't make a penny off of YouTube. Um, it's mostly just there as an archive at this point. So, if you've missed streams and you want to see, like, specific uh, parts of runs or something like that, or you want to go back and watch, like, a specific boss fight or something like that, the uh, YouTube channel is probably the easiest way to find that stuff. One whole Spelunker potion. Woo. Hoo. So exciting. Party time's over.
We're gonna go back to the ice biome and have one last good look around. Cosplay Souls mod on uh, Dark Souls? Uh, I have not. Still need to finish up the bow only run. You know, we haven't been down here. Let's go ahead and do that. Yeah. Really funny. Check it out on Lobos' channel. Okay. I'll give it a look. Do you enjoy some Dark Souls? Um, let's go ahead and uh, let's go down from here. Like good old games. Yeah, yeah. I was just having a uh, conversation with a um, coworker of mine earlier today, actually, and uh, he's going to be getting a switch. He was thinking about picking up the Skyrim uh, port for the switch, and uh, I tried to convince him that he should wait until next month and just get uh, Dark Souls Remastered. Because he's never played either of those games. Uh, well, I think he's played, like, a couple of minutes of Dark Souls on, like, a friend of his uh, like, file. Oh, God. That's a little spooky. I like these guys. I don't remember this is a hardcore run. There's a chest nearby, huh? Eh, I had a feeling it was a water chest. It's fine. Don't have any ideas, edition. Hey, if I gave you a license to print money, you would definitely use it. Um, don't get me wrong. I don't think Skyrim's a bad game. I just don't think it's nearly good enough to warrant being ported to every single new console from now until... Forever. <laughs> yeah, see, a game shouldn't have to be, uh, ha it shouldn't have to have that qualifier. Have to go? Alright. Well, thanks for hanging out. Uh, Tom Tomaliax? Tom Tomalaxel? Tomalaxic? I'm not entirely sure how to say that. Thank you for the follow. Alright, we need to... Kronk Nasty, how's it going? It's my favorite part of Terraria. Uh, probably early game when we're weak and pathetic and have no, you know, good way of defending ourselves. Only been one streamer who said it correctly the first try. Rip. Well, uh... <laughs> I 
At least that was good for a laugh, huh? Um, then down through here. Get out of your bat. Uh, I also like early hard mode. For kind of the same reason. Zack? Ah, uh, well... Um, I mean, in most cases, the letter X is pronounced like a Z. In most cases. Skeleton dude. How's it going? Buy some bombs. Oh, actually, you know what? No, never mind. I don't need to buy some bombs. We'll sell those. And that's... That nah. seems good. It's true. You don't you don't say Z in taxi. Nah, I think we're just gonna go down from here. Life crystal nearby. Isn't something we need. Well, I mean, it's not a bad thing to pick up by any means. Really, I would just like a double jump. And, uh, Gravitation Potion, Featherfall, and start looking for Sky Islands. Rupees worth picking up. That is a lot of dudes. Glitchless? Uh, I mean, I might occasionally use a, a hoik or something, but yeah, basically glitchless. I don't dupe anything. Um, don't use invulnerability machines, like, none, none of those tricks. Yeah, I do use uh, liquid duplication just because it's really just a time saver. I could just go refill buckets a million times or make a bunch of buckets. But it's just, just a, you know, all I'm doing is saving time. It's not detracting any kind of challenge to things. <laughs> this isn't Minecraft. Well, you're right, it's not Minecraft. Um, man. Can't believe we haven't found a single... Um... Blizzard in a bottle in this place. We've done a pretty thorough look of the, uh, look through. Like, a couple of areas. Our 
really a whole lot. I kind of want to pick this life crystal up wherever it is, um, mostly because it interferes with our... Uh, life crystals have a higher priority on the list of things that show up with the metal detector. So as long as that's showing up on the metal detector, if, if, even if there's a chest nearby as well, uh, it's going to display the life crystal over that. Also, we can make heart lanterns. Boss HP count? Oh, that that's for... Uh, that's just a, a little gimmick thing. Um, anytime somebody cheers with uh, bits or subscribes or something like that, it knocks some of the HP off. It's kind of a... it's just a gimmicky thing. It doesn't have anything to do with Terraria. Hey, Dr. Kill Me Boy. How's it going? Mm. Not sure exactly where I want to uh, look. It's quite small. Can't see what it says. Uh, it is pretty small. Uh, basically, the person that, like, does the finishing blow, so to speak, like, uh, if it gets down to zero from somebody cheering with bits or subscribing or something like that, um, their name, and if they have a Twitch, like, uh, user icon, that'll show up on there along with their name, and uh, then people can take it from there. It's kind of like a... I don't know. Just a little side thing for... Uh, ah. No problem. No, I don't have any mods installed or anything like that, so... This is, uh, completely vanilla. Ah, there's a chest nearby. Let's see if we can find it. Hopefully it's not another water chest. Enemy in here somewhere. Mouse over it. Ah, snowflakes. Yeah, sword only. Well, it's a uh, it's a hardcore run, so want to give it some additional challenge other than just a hardcore run. Uh, it's another freaking water chest. Don't care, video game. Well, Featherfall Potion's good. Do care about that. Oh, and there's another chest nearby. It's probably in the granite biome, though. Oh, no, it's not. Sweet. Alright, please. Blizzard in the bottle. No. Son of a gun. I'd have to settle for uh, just a cloud in a bottle. Didn't even found one of those yet, though. Ah! 
All right, no problem. Well, uh, thanks for the follow again, and uh, thanks for hanging out. Excuse me, sir. Could you please not do that? Thank you for dying. Also, don't want to leave the chests. It interferes with the metal detector. Maybe after looking on your or your live stream. Ah, came over from Badger Stream. It's a good guy, that their video game Badger. You know, I'll be doing uh, multiplayer again on well, the, the co-op playthrough on Friday. Ah, Badger's Discord Promotions. All right, so there's that. Another chest nearby. Tap a pride. Good. Well, lots of mirrors we don't need. And an elemental place. What are you doing? Out of here. Life crystal nearby. Excuse me. I gotta say, the uh, granite biome is a lot less scary <laughs> than the marble biome. going that way. Alright, that's probably about the line as far as uh depth that we need to uh, be at. And go up a little higher. You know what would be an interesting addition would be bombs that have a shorter uh, fuse, so to speak. Bombs that go off faster. go about things. Maybe I should go back up and try bombing down into here. That. Inventory's pretty full anyway. Go ahead and sell some stuff we don't need.
Right. So, we're going to go back over there, and uh, this time we're just going to bomb. Actually, first let's... Just some of these pumpkins. Some delicious pumpkin pie. Heading on back. I'd like to have a double jump and, um... It's really about all we need other than gravitation potions. We can go look for a Star Fury. to have that for the uh Rain of Cthulhu. Marcus, how's it going? Welcome. Penny for my thoughts. I appreciate the cheers. <laughs> uh, my thoughts are, um, this is a video game and we're playing it. I'd like to get a Star Fury before we take on Brain of Cthulhu. Um, it's really my priority right now is getting a double jump and some gravitation potion. There's a chest nearby. The sad thing is, is I may have to cut the stream short at some point. Got a plumber supposed to be coming out to the house at some point this evening. It's like a pipe or something leaking, causing some water damage on the ceiling downstairs. And neither of my roommates are going to be here. They'll be working, so be the only one home. Not sure when he's supposed to be here yet, though. It does suck. I mean, it's a rental, so at least uh, it's not something I got to pay for. Landlord's uh, responsibility. At least there's that. Oh my gosh. Video game. Double jump, please. It does. It's just uh, annoying having to wait for somebody when you have no idea when they're going to be here. Make sure that was the chest that was showing up on here earlier. Yep, looks like it. Double jump, what's that? Uh, I don't know. Apparently we're not gonna find one. You might wanna move, slimes. Slimes, move! Don't do it! side of slimes. They jumped into the bomb's blast. It wasn't my fault.
Dubba, dubba jump. <laughs> Ruroni. D dubba jump. Uh, I'll remember that. Dubba, dubba jump. No idea where this chest is. Double jump shrimp. Okay. Uh, I, that sounds great. I'll, I'll take, um, five pounds. This double, double jump shrimp. <laughs> Moving away from the chest. Leads me to believe it's maybe over here. Yep. Please. Oh, please, for the love of... Video game. Come on. I mean, I'll take some rubies. Okay with rubies. Let's take a look at the map. Um, I should probably go over here to like the edge. Bomb down again. I think we're gonna have to give up on a uh, lizard in a bottle. Still no gravitation potion either. It's your favorite sting song, Blizzard in a Bottle? <laughs> Good. Good. I'm glad to hear that. Lizard in a bottle? Is that torture? Uh, I don't know about torture, but definitely animal cruelty. It's acceptable in most countries. Flippers. Not something I normally use, but it's useful in certain situations like this. Spider in a bottle? I really wouldn't mind a flare gun either. Snowball cannon? Well, it's sword only, so I don't need a snowball cannon. Snowballs are not a sword. However, a flare gun is a tool, not a weapon. So I can use that in any run. Just saw the stream description. No problem. I mean, Snowball Cannon's fun. Its window of usefulness is pretty short, though. That's Cap Emote. 
Uh, don't have one of those. That's good enough. <laughs> All right. Um. I mean, this right here is pretty much the level where uh, no longer have ice biome. Like a little, little area here and here, but I think for the most part, pretty much explored it all. Well, no blizzard. Fine. And buy some more bombs. I think I'm gonna go go ahead and get started on the elevator a little bit, and uh, then we might go to the jungle. What's going on there? Good. A very messy spawn area. Run away, squirrel, run! Don't do it! Squirrels these days. I had a better pickaxe, I'd just mine, but... Just in the arms of an angel now. Sounds good. Yeah, I have some glow sticks. Just throw them down. do speed runs really and uh, I'm not gonna be uh, I I don't really use the dupe glitch there will be no duping um, the only glitch I normally use is like water duplication and even then I usually prefer to uh, for, like, making a fishing spot, I usually prefer to just find an area that already has water in it. And just kind of level it out. Um, I will use hoiks on occasion, but no invulnerability machines, no uh, duping, nothing like that. Ah, yeah, no, speedrunning's not really my thing. Um, to be precise, I'm not good at speedrunning. <laughs> so, uh, it takes a different kind of skill set. Fine with these hardcore runs. That's not a big deal. Badger had great things to say about me. He's a filthy liar. Don't listen to a thing he has to say. <laughs> no, Badger's a good guy. I have a traveling merchant. Still no freaking double jump. Uh, 
Don't do it. Stay out of the bombing path. I can't do anything about suicidal enemies. If they're just gonna jump into the, uh, the path of these bombs, it's their own fault. I'm just trying to do a nice controlled demolition. These fools are just jumping to their death. Oh, with non module glitches, honestly. Glitchless. Goes. Oh, yeah, I mean, for speedruns, yeah, definitely. Like, if, you know. If you're putting glitchless in the title of a speedrun, then it needs to be glitchless entirely. But. Um, I think that's more, like, speedrun stuff, personally. As far as I'm concerned, people can play the video game however they want to play the video game, and I'll play the game how I want to play it. Uh, that's kind of how I feel. Even for runs like this, um, sword only, some people might want to use, like, the two scythe weapons as a sword. I wouldn't count them as swords, because they're not swords. <laughs> Even though, well, you know, but in the wiki, they're listed with the swords, because they operate the same way. Um, some people would list those. Me personally, I'm not going to. I don't think there's anything wrong with it. It's not how I want to do it. But also make the game a lot, it'd make this run a lot easier if we could use the death sickle. Um, well, maybe not a lot easier. The Icicle, definitely. The Icicle's a pretty good weapon. Um, but we'll be fine. We're playing on Crimson. I'll be using the, uh, be fishing for the, uh, Blade Tongue. Be using that for Destroyer. And to some degree, well, uh, that and the, um, what do you call it? Ice Brand. Frost Brand? Whatever it's called. Frost Brand. Ice Brand. Mm, there's a chest nearby, and I don't know where. I also want to go back up to see what the Traveling Merchant has. Also need to be careful because I don't have a double jump. Hmm. No. This granite biome. That makes sense. So. I've uh, used the Blade Tongue for a Destroyer before. That'll make that fight comically easy. Um, Skeletron Prime is a little bit tougher, but still not too bad with the sword. Um, the Twins are the are the, the difficult fight with uh, sword only. Most of the challenge comes from being able to do enough damage before morning. You have to play real aggressive. We'll likely be doing some nurse spamming for the twins fight. Um, Plantera is not too bad because I'll be. Uh, getting the Terra Blade first before we do Plantera. Where are we? We are in the underground. We did the first little section of the elevator.
Still no double jump though. Life form analyzer. We do not have one yet. Have that. Sell a few things. Sell that, but whatever. Mm, do we want Saki? Why not? Oh, let's talk with my coworker. Oh, about uh, getting Dark Souls instead of Skyrim. Yeah, I mean, I don't think Skyrim's a bad game, but me personally, if I had never played either of them before, or if I could go back and play either of them and have like the the experience of playing them for the first time. Uh, definitely Dark Souls. <laughs> definitely Dark Souls. I think overall it is a vastly superior game to Skyrim. But again, that's an opinion. I uh, really just need a gravitation potion. Yeah, I mean... <sighs> Favorite might be Demon Souls. Uh, Demon Souls is the only one I've never, never played any of. Um, I would like to. I would need to get a capture card first. And obviously the game, but I mean, I've got a PlayStation 3, so that part's not a problem. Um, I think we're going to go to the jungle. Yeah, it's just the combat. It's just, really, it's the combat. It's just boring to me. It's just the same thing over and over. That's a nice analogy. I like that. Well, you know what? Just like seafood, Dark Souls isn't for everybody. <laughs> I think the analogy still holds up. <laughs> hmm. I'm gonna take these Spelunker potions and these two mining potions and these hunter potions. Jungle's a bit spooky. Anything else? No. Nope. Good. <clears throat> uh, yep, yep, yep. Obvious Dark Souls reference is obvious. Tell you what, uh, fighting fighting art with the uh, with a bow was interesting. Still surprised we managed to do that first try. Sorry, slime. Didn't mean to bump into you. And yes, I've, I've started calling Artorius Art for short. Don't ask me why. Because it seems like the, you know, shortened version of the name Artorius, but... It's gonna see skinning it, processing etc., and then getting to eat it. And Skyrim is Burger King. Yes, have it your way. As long as your way uh, includes a, a healthy helping of glitches. Very, very healthy helping of glitches. Uh, I will say that Skyrim is very good for wasting time. Like, if you just want something to pass the time, that is a very good game for that. Very easy to get sidetracked, just kind of get lost doing things. Busy work. So, I mean, if that's what you're looking for, that's, uh, 
could definitely do worse. I still gotta figure out a way to uh, be able to properly stream Dark Souls 3. Man, this game is just throwing flippers at us. Ah, uh, my uh, one of my roommates is playing Witcher 3 and has been for quite some time. Pretty long game, from what I understand. Oh, I have it. My computer just can't handle streaming it and playing it at the same time. If I wanted to just play the game through, I can play it through just fine on lower graphical settings. It's just the combination of running the stream and the game is just, it's too much for my computer. I get lots of quite comical bugs and glitches going on. No, it's, uh, what I'd need is a, uh, I, I'm pretty sure what I really would need is a CPU upgrade. I mean, I've got a 1050 Ti. It's a decent graphics card. Not, like, the top of the line, but it's pretty decent. Um... I mean, I'm pretty much right smack dab in the middle of between, like, the minimum set, uh, you know, requirements and the recommended requirements for the game. And I don't want to, I mean, I would like to stream it, and I'd like to stream it, you know, as close to a, a blind playthrough as I can. Um... Which is why I haven't just gone through and played it by myself. <clears throat> Cost a kilo of <laughs> pure gold and your firstborn son. Alright, sounds good. You have to wait a while on that firstborn son business. Crystal Barrel... Crystal Barrel Fox? Crystal Barrel? Think I'm saying that right? How's it going? Welcome. Currently experiencing the bloodiest of moons here in the jungle. Slime's place, just go away. Oh god. Spike slime, die in a fire, please. I hate you. Man, this game really doesn't want to give us a double jump. Key configuration for Terraria? Um, well, me, the only keys I've bothered to rebind are the potion and mana potion keys, and I rebound those to my side mouse buttons. Can't really pull my mouse up in front of the camera, otherwise I'd show you, but it's got uh, two, two little side buttons. Yeah, I just play around with it and try to see what's comfortable. Um, I didn't bother rebinding the hotbar 
I just prioritize the first like couple of spots for important things, and because uh, I can, you know, easily reach the one through like four keys. Um, and I typically only have like one or two weapons on my hotbar at a time. And I'll just use the scroll wheel if I have to uh, do anything too far. Neo? I've heard mixed things about Neo. I have not played it. I've heard very mixed things. Some people really like it, some people not so much. I don't know. Very different view with the uh, all these potions running. Oh, mouse and keyboard. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, mean, I can't imagine playing like Dark Souls with a mouse and keyboard, and I imagine Neo's. Probably similar in a lot of respects. I would love to get that chest, but I really don't want to deal with all of these guys. I can do it anyway. Worst case scenario, we run. Samurai souls. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, certain games just work better with a controller. Certain games definitely work better with a mouse and keyboard. Like, I would have a really hard time playing Terraria with a, with a controller. Got lucky when doing a sword-only run and found an Arcalis. Arcalis is pretty neat. Wouldn't mind one of those. Uh, definitely, if we were doing Corruption, be pretty fantastic against uh, Eater of Worlds. But... Run a Crimson World. The Arcalis falls off pretty darn hard. It's a neat sword. Not the most useful one, though. Really just need a gravitation potion. Excuse me, sir. Yeah. Medusa head. Uh, pretty sure that's only in hard mode now. Now though, they they moved the uh, Medusa to only being in hard mode. So by the time you get that, it's kind of borderline useless, honestly. I would be okay with them buffing that weapon a little bit.